at the beautiful offices of Hogan Lovells for the final of the Prince's Trust Enterprise Challenge and it has been absolutely thrilling. We've not had many dinner times, not had many after schools, all we've been doing is trying to get this right. We put a really, like, lot of time and effort to it. We even came to school in our holidays. It's like a roller coaster, really. Ups and downs, hard times trying to work on this game. We just hope that we could make our region and our school proud. I'm glad we got through the regionals and both now. Here we are, London, the big city. Amazing, very inspiring. Good to see a lot of young, bright, budding entrepreneurs with so many great ideas. They're only three minutes long, so they had to get the correct information in within the right time period. Uh, and I think all of them were great and delivered it exceptionally. Especially when you think how old they are. To do that at my age, I definitely would be able to do it. Very, very well received from the judges. Last year, official figures showed that there was a 45% increase in the number of fatal stabbing victims aged 16 to 24 in England alone. It's Sunday school for refugees, but we will help them understand our culture, learn the English language and general life skills. We have a robust marketing strategy that engages the best 14 to 15 year old Braveheart minds in the country. Well, in Scotland anyway. <laughs> <laughs> All you are so good to help their teachers job more manageable. Introducing AI Class! And the winner of the 2019 Enterprise Challenge, Team AI Dixon oh. I'm shocked, I can't speak! Ecstatic, it's amazing to win it, it's been absolutely a massive opportunity. Nothing more than what I expected, of course. <laughs> it's got all these gadgets, look, there's even a TV! <laughs> Free water and all. Abaji, you're covering up the fridge. Look, the fridge! Look, come in here. Once in a lifetime opportunity. I think the Enterprise Challenge is a hugely important initiative to be able to give young people the chance to really accelerate their skills. This is about aspiration and it's about showing what's possible. It really gives them a sense of hope. Things are achievable no matter where you come from or the circumstances that you're in. After all that hard work we put in, it was just amazing to know that we've actually won. We've come this far and we deserve this win. <laughs> <laughs>